Hey YouTube, this is me again, Ali Ayakani, or you could call me Gaiga Hellblaze. Sorry if my desk is a mess, but it will be cleaned up whenever I can get around to it. This is where I uh, leave my stuff here. I have a crappy entertainment center, so don't mind the mess. So ignore it. Well, today I got a package, and this is a package that I pre-ordered. This is from Sunny Shore, and I took the regular package off because it had my address on it. I don't want you guys to see that. So I took this out. So I'm going to show you what I got to, uh, for pre-ordering. I love this bag. This is one thing I like about Sunny Shore. They give you a cute little bag that comes from the Pokemon Center itself, which we don't get. I like the Pokemon bags. They're really cute. Oh, ho, ho. What we got here? Uh-oh. He's wrapped in a whole bunch of bubble wrap. Oh. I really don't like bubble wraps, but... I guess you got to have a bubble wrap. Let's move this all aside. Let me show you. I hate this camera. It's the shiny Genesect Poke Doll. Hmm. You know, I thought he would be a little bit bigger than that, but I would have to say, he looks really cute. I don't know what you guys think, but this is the Giny Genesect that is going to be at the next Pokemon movie in Japan, which is showing already. So if anybody in Japan hasn't seen it, I recommend it. Um... For us, though, I think the uh, movie is going to be out on Cartoon Network because they always do that on Cartoon Network. They bring the movie onto Cartoon Network. It's not going to be in theaters because I think the theaters have stopped with the Pokemon movies ever since Pokemon Heroes. But when Pokemon Black and White came out, they released Pokemon White in theaters and Pokemon Black on Cartoon Network. So, I don't know what's up with that. Oh, his arm is kind of weird looking. It won't move. There we go. I guess he's just going to have to sit like this because his arms are so tiny and everything. Well, just by looking at the Poke Doll, I guess he's alright. But they could have made him uh, his uh, body here a little bigger, because if you see the head, it's in a canyon. It's so huge, and his look and his big head cannot support this little body. Look at that! I like the tag though. Look at that tag. Poor Genesect with a tiny little body and a big head. I don't know what they were doing with his body and everything, but... I don't know. It's kind of funky and weird. But he is well worth it. He's a shiny in the movie. There's one shiny and the rest were all four original Genesects, so... I don't know. I I don't know what happens in the movie. I just know that he's gonna fight Mewtwo, and Mewtwo is in his uh, form, in a new form, and the two will duke it out, like battle. And he and just in the Pokédex, like it says, he is created by Team Plasma. See, he doesn't even stand up correctly. But what the hell? So this is my latest to get. Um, whenever I get paid again, 
I will get Mewtwo, the Mewtwo Poke Doll, and I hear he is a really good plush, so I will get him because I don't even have a Mewtwo, and Mewtwo is extremely popular. Look at that, he cannot even sit down. This poor shiny Genesect. This head is big, but look at his body. So small. What did they do to him? I never seen a Pokemon that cannot. S I never seen a Pokemon plush like him that cannot sit properly. They either made his body too small or they didn't put much stuffing in it. That's my only problem. But this is my get for today. This is the unboxing. Um, the rest of my money I'm going to spend on the Godzilla comics. I am way overdue. And I haven't been getting that because I've been getting Pokemon plush. And so I'm taking a break for uh, Pokemon plush. And I'm getting my Godzilla comics at my comic shop. Uh, probably uh, today or tomorrow. So... Yeah, that, and this is my gift for today. I had to renew my Xbox Live last night, so the rest is going to go towards my uh, Godzilla comics. But, I have to say I'm glad I pre-ordered this, but for him not being able to stand up correctly, <clears throat> sorry if my, my voice is sounding like this, I didn't have any water, I just woke up and saw him. I had to make a video. But... Um, I would have to say I would give him a 7 out of 10, and the reason why is because his body is small, he can't sit properly unless you have other plush to support him on sitting up, and his head is so big, and so is his cannon. But it's the body, his body here is very, very small, and he can't sit properly. So, a 7 out of 10 for this shiny Genesect. Um, I, would act, I would actually rather, if anybody is planning on getting Pokemon plushies that, commem that commemorates the movie, I would rather get the regular one because that one will sit up properly and this one won't and you won't have problems with uh, a Genesect with a big head and a little body who flops over and can't sit properly so get the regular one they have two varieties they have one that's um, they have one that's um, opposable and then they have the regular one by Takaria Tommy so I recommend either one of those, but the posable one is more expensive than the regular, so get that one. But if you want a Pokédell, go right ahead, but you're going to have problems with the shiny Genesect here on uh, not sitting up properly. So get a regular one instead. I hope you like my video. I will try and submit other videos like Halo videos this week. I am so sorry for not doing that. So, I will submit some Halo videos. I have a lot of fail videos. So, be sure to see some Halo videos over the week. I'll submit them. And starting next month, you will see me, you will see uh, Halo videos that are even a lot better. Like the one that I just showed you of Halo Reach, fa Halo Reach and Four Fails and Wins that video if you remember it with a song on it that one was done by a Mac computer and since I'm going back to college next month I will be submitting fail videos and stuff from the Mac computer and they will be a lot better in quality I don't have a Mac computer nor a better program for my computer so I will do it at the at the college and I will bring it home and then I'll submit the submit to it on uh, YouTube so be sure to watch out for any more videos of that I'm gonna I am definitely gonna make videos from the Mac computer so until then see you guys hope you like my unboxing